So back with the vegans of Instagram, let's just get straight to it. Uh, let's just start with Healthy by Wendy, okay? She's just terrifying, isn't she? She's just scary in general. The picture is so professional, it even looks like it's really been airbrushed and everything, and it's still, she looks really frightening and decaying and still got black, uh, I don't know, black spots or black stuff in her teeth and her gum tissue right there looks really bad. Yeah. This is also by Healthy by Wendy. How do you get enough nutrients? And then she has this like chickpeas and plain um, cauliflower, I guess, in a bowl and she pours this stuff on it. It looks so nasty. Um, I mean, I got some screenshots, but I don't feel like that's doing it justice. I got to go and see if she still has the video up <laughs> and see if I could put that in here. So I'm over here to get this video and look at her, y'all. I bet she gives her son nightmares. That's why he gives her the finger. But look at this disgusting garbage that does not look appetizing she probably gives this to her son like this is all he's ever known his whole life this nasty ass food she is way overdue for being arrested this is hannah mcneely and just the color of her lips nope her overall look she's 35 it just shows me personally that she's just very unhealthy and she is nursing. She got a baby. It's just like, please eat some meat. Okay, this is Shane Sterling. Check out what he writes. I make $500,000 a year. And it's not about the freaking money. No, of course not. Of course not. It's Shane Sterling. Of course it's not about. Okay, this is the Peace and Raw family. And they have a baby. And fortunately so far, the baby looks normal and um, healthy, hopefully leaching everything out of the mother's bones for the baby, you know, and hopefully till the baby gets big enough to go with the grandparents and stuff for other people to watch the baby and give the baby some normal food. And if you um, have checked out some of my other videos, you might recognize this lady, but her husband is the one that looks really, really scary and sickly. Um, I might see if I can put a picture of him in here now, you know, so I'm surprised and impressed that they have a baby that so far looks like they're alive, at least. Fully Raw Christina's grandfather turned 100 years old, and I got a few screenshots um, of the event, and Christina looks kind of scary in some of it. <laughs> but yeah, he lived to be 100 years old, not even raw. Okay, this is Back to Live by Chef India with something that looks like some nasty vegan tonic. And her nails, her fingernails are so pale. Like, your nails are not supposed to be this color. Your nail beds are not supposed to be this pale, colorless. Vegan lady, I don't know if she's raw. <laughs> Somebody told me that she's in her 20s and she looks really anemic and sick and she's eating this coconut that's like super moldy. I heard of somebody, maybe it was on Ch Chubby Emu channel, but I watch out if you get on that channel, eating a moldy ass coconut or drinking some old coconut water. But somebody did write in the comments, the first coconut was full of mold, super dangerous. And look at it. That's clearly bad. That's clearly off. But she, I don't know. I mean, she zoomed in into the close up, so she must not be aware Oh, Joey Carbstrong saying God wants animals to be vegan. Even God wants animals to be vegan? He's lost his mind. He's lost his marbles. If he ever, he, I mean, he never really had any, but um, Joey Carbstrong wrote, stop fighting the will of God with a little G and live vegan. Yeah, your veganism is your God. Funny how vegans are already living in alignment with God's perfect paradise. What? So you think that the diet alone is in alignment with God's perfect paradise. It's all about food. Y'all are insane. Your religion is veganism. You don't know what... There are vegans out here lying all the time. Telling bold-faced lies. But they're already living in alignment with God's perfect paradise because it's all about being vegan and diet. Yet Christian and Jewish meat eaters constantly argue against veganism in favor of the worst crimes against God with little G's creatures for the sake of palate pre pleasure. I wonder if those who show no mercy to animals will be shown mercy by little G God in the time of judgment. Okay, Peta shared this thing where this vegan lady went to the Michael Kors event. I don't even know how she got in. like, she, <laughs> But she was there and there was like celebrities there and everything. And she's like, all of a sudden she um, starts shouting and holding up her little sign saying Angora is torture. And then um, security got to come and drag her out of there. 
somehow in the middle of this whole thing, like where she's getting dragged away, she gets, I don't know if there's another vegan nearby to hand her her fake bunny ears for PETA. I don't know, but I thought it was funny. Look at these vegan ribs. It's like fake vegan pork on uh, sugar cane sticks. Looks like they put a lot of work into that. At Yovan and her baby, they look so beautiful, so healthy, and she is eating good. Um, this is from the Raw Vegan Family. Turmeric is great for making things cheese colored. In the Raw Vegan Cuisine, cheese colored? So it's just about like the color and stuff because you put that much turmeric, turmeric, how do you pronounce it? Sorry, I always say turmeric. Turmeric. You put that much, it's going to taste peppery and, uh, and kind of dry and grainy like that's but she again she said cheese color so she didn't say anything about cheese taste like she just wants the color so <laughs> yeah it's gonna taste like eating a big bowl of spice probably with no salt look at that look at that yummy Matt drain writer this is the last thing i'm gonna share in this video drain writer shared these images of uh natasha standing next to people i guess that they come across in public that are like overweight and stuff and i guess she just stands next to them or something like that like I don't know like and it's obviously staged it's like, what do they say to each other when they say oh look at that look at that person let's go stand on take a picture what <laughs> they are so weird anyway um both these ladies look sick to me to be honest but they both look sick we just said opposite ends of the spectrum